All right, guys, quick lesson on indirect connections. Here we have a kitchen sink, serving actually a bar sink specifically. We've got a requisite P-trap. We have two inlet connections here. One is going to be picking up the ice maker, and of course this is the drain for the ice maker. And if you do connect the ice maker, it's going to loop up as high below the countertop as possible because you definitely don't want any sewage coming back and going into the ice maker because this will definitely be consumed by people. So you don't want that contaminated. And the second connection here we have is for a dishwasher. Both of these indirect connections allowed. Of course, dishwasher as well, up as high below the countertop as possible, but upstream before the trap, not after the trap, because this will leave it subject to sewer gas, comes down, and of course we have our requisite clean out that picks up our kitchen sink. And we're done.